Larry Wilkins loves the silence of his electric car. His Nissan Leaf zips along with surprising speed. It's the first 20, 30 feet that has a, a lot more pickup than a gas vehicle does. But his car has limitations. It can only go 120 kilometers before it has to be plugged in. I did uh, create a plan to try and drive to Toronto with this thing. And, and it was gonna take me two days to do it. So what do you think? There's a buzz about electric cars right now. Tesla recently introduced a new model with a longer range and a lower price of $35,000. Other companies are doing it too. Outside of a few pockets, Canada is still a long way from having a dependable network. Most charging stations, like this one, take four to six hours to charge a car. There are very few high-speed stations that can do it in under half an hour, making consumers wary. Electric car advocates call it range anxiety. People imagine they're going to be out there driving and they think, well, where am I going to plug in? There are more than 18,400 electric cars on the road in Canada. Most of them are in three provinces, Quebec, Ontario and B.C. Those provinces are investing millions into charging stations. But right now there are only about 3,500 spots to recharge, including 102 that are Tesla only. Making a long distance trip with an electric car a time consuming slog. We have to make it ultimately affordable and practical. The federal minister in charge has a new fund of nearly $63 million to help him do it. Jim Carr says he'll be asking for proposals from the private sector in the next few months to develop a fast charging network. This investment uh, in electrical vehicles is a prudent way to proceed, but Prudent doesn't mean that you take your time, so we also understand that there's urgency. Electric car groups say the country has about two years to get its act together. You have a lot of people signing up to buy those cars, and so there is some urgency to get the infrastructure out there so that by the time those cars are delivered, end of 2017, early 2018, you know, the infrastructure is there. In the meantime, when Larry Wilkins wants to drive out of town, he has to use his old gas car, leaving his favorite electric vehicle in the garage. Margaret McDermott, CBC News, Ottawa.